Want to grow your email list on YouTube? It's the second largest search engine on the web, and it's a great way to generate more leads for your business. So in this video, we're going to show you how you can build your email list using YouTube. Be sure to check out the links that we've left in the description, hit that subscribe button and notification bell, and be part of the conversation. Lead magnets are free action-packed content items you'll offer your viewers in exchange for their email address. Lead magnets can be things like PDF checklists, reports, ebooks, white papers, or premium videos. Now, one of the most effective types of lead magnets is a content upgrade. You can easily create one of these by merely condensing the main points of your YouTube video's message into one PDF. For example, James Wedmore, a video marketing strategy expert, created a PDF content upgrade that goes along with his video on how to create a sales video, the eight-step formula. This is not only beneficial to his viewers, but it also serves as a great lead magnet. Now, we've got a handy 63-point checklist for creating the ultimate opt-in form for your website that you'll definitely want to read, so we'll leave a link in the description. Now, once you've created a lead magnet, you'll need to promote it by adding a call to action on your videos. A call to action is just when you ask your viewers to do something like like a video or subscribe to a channel. But in this case, you'll be asking your viewers to download your lead magnet. Now, we're going to show you a simple three-step call to action formula that James uses for his lead magnet. He states a qualifying question, then a value proposition, and then how they can get it. First, he asks the qualifying question. Looking to create the perfect sales video? Then he introduces the value of the resource that he's created. I put these eight sales video steps together. And finally, he tells his viewers exactly how they can get his lead magnet. Simply click the link in the description box below. See how easy that is? All right, great. Now that you've got a call to action, you'll need to add a link to your website with an opt-in form where viewers can download your lead magnet. Now, here's a quick list of all the places you should include the links to your opt-in form on your YouTube channel. Number one, in your video description. Your viewers will naturally look for a link to your content upgrade in the description section of your YouTube video, so make sure you include it there, and keep in mind that you'll need to use the full URL in the description, so be sure to include the HTTPS in any of your links, or they won't be clickable. Number two, in your channel header. Now you can place a link to your lead magnet in your channel header by first clicking on your channel icon, and then click on the YouTube Studio in the drop-down menu. Now on the left side of the screen, click on Customization. Next, you'll need to click on the Basic Info tab at the top. Then click on Add Link and fill in the link title and URL. Now once you're done, just be sure to click the Publish button at the top right corner of the screen. All right, number three is in the About tab. One of the most overlooked places to include a lead magnet is in your About page. Your biggest fans are going to go there to look for more information about you. So, to place that link in your About page, just go to your YouTube studio, as we described a moment ago, and then you'll need to click on Customization at the bottom left of the screen. Next, you'll need to click on the Basic Info tab. Now, place a URL to your lead magnet in the channel description box along with your regular channel's description, and be sure to click Publish when you're done. All right, now we're at number four, in your replies to comments. Now, often viewers will leave a comment on your channel asking you for more information about what you've covered in a video. So, if it seems appropriate, just drop a link to your content upgrade or other type of lead magnet in your reply. Number five, on YouTube cards. Cards look great on all devices and they're easy to use and they're more interactive. To place a link to your content using YouTube cards, you'll need to click the YouTube Studio link under your channel icon. Then, on the left side of the screen, click on videos. Next, hover your mouse over the video that you'd like to add a card to, and then click the pencil icon. Now, on the right side of the screen, click on the Cards tab. Then you'll need to click on Link. Now just fill out the fields, insert the image, and drag the playhead to the location where you'd like your card to appear. Keep in mind, to use the Link feature in your YouTube cards, you'll need to be a YouTube partner. You'll need to have added your site as an associated website to your channel, and any link that you place on a card must begin with the URL to your own domain. All right, so far we've covered how to create a lead magnet, adding a call to action, where you need to create links on your channel, and now we'll look at YouTube ads. YouTube ads allow you to take your list building to the next level. Once you've joined the YouTube Partner Program, you'll find that you can use different types of ads and you can choose where they'll appear on your videos. 
You can use ad targeting to display your ads based on age, gender, location, interest, and more. If you'd like to learn more about YouTube ad targeting, we'll leave a link in the description. If you want to get the most out of your YouTube channel, check out our guide to YouTube SEO, remarketing to YouTube viewers, and optimizing your YouTube channel for business. Now give these YouTube optimizations for building your email list a try. Let us know how it works out for you. Why not use Optin Monster and instantly grow your email list, get more leads, and increase your sales? To get a special discount, check out the link in the description. And to learn more Optin Monster tips, tricks, and techniques, just click on the video that's on your screen now.